my name is Libby Birch and today's topic is about balance. Now I know most of you are heading into your BCE, so you might be in year 10, 11 or you might be completing your last year of school at year 12. I know exactly how these years feel. I just finished my BCE in 2015 and I can completely understand the stresses and the, everything going on and it's a really stressful year and it's it's really it's really quite hard and it's really quite tough and sometimes you can get to it get to the end or you can get to some points during the year where you just go oh I, I can't really can't really do this anymore but you just have to keep going and, and it's only one more year in your 12 and, and you've finished at the end of the year and you've got your exams and then you're all done and dusted. So today is really about well how do we balance our sport along with our school and along with being a great person because it's all about being the best athlete you can be, being the best student you can be, and being the best person you can be. And a wise person once told me that you have to be a good person first before you can be a good athlete and a good student. So the year can, might contain a lot of sacrifices, and usually the hardest choices you have to make are usually the best ones. So it might be, for example, that you can't, go, you can't go and see your friends on a Saturday, you have to spend some more time on your study. But these sacrifices all add up in the end to a great result. They're all about the one percenters. Now some people might say you have to give up your sport to, be, to enable you to do well in your studies. And truly, I don't truly believe in that. It's all about management, organisation, working hard and having a support team around you. The one key message I would, I would put forward to you all is, is this support team is really important. So whether that's your parents, your teachers or your coaches, make sure everyone's on board your goals and your dreams for that year. Now, it's, you have, don't, don't stress at all about giving up sport because you don't have to. I completed the 21 and under Victorian state team in Tasmania and I did all my trainings and also completed year 12 and got to a physiotherapy degree. So I completed all my goals all the while balancing both being a good person, a student and an athlete. So even though the year might contain some sacrifices, it is important to believe that these are contributing to a bigger picture. And in the end, it truly does. So make sure you balance both your sport, school and being a good person.